Good morning. It's John and it is 626. I am waiting for that breakfast area to open up here at Joe Dodge Lodge for 630 breakfast. And then it's back on trail. Uh, I'll show you. That's the hill somewhere behind there that I have to get to the top of up in those clouds, Wildcat D to start the day. Hoping to go 13 something miles to Imp Shelter, Imp Campsite. Um, there's a couple spots past that uh, that are stealth campsites, but that's like a full service shelter and some tenting platforms and stuff. Weather's weird. It's like, could go up to 70 and it could be breezy and rainy. I, I don't know. Uh, it, the weather around here changes constantly and uh, immediately. So yeah, that's what we're going to do today. Um, for today's Would You Rather, I'm going to do this now so I can focus on the big climb getting uh, after breakfast, get right on the trail. Um, today's Would You Rather, we'll go back to authors. Would you rather, if you could only read one author for the rest of your life, would you rather read Tom Clancy, the works of Tom Clancy, or the works of Stephen King? We'll go with Stephen King since we're almost, almost to Maine, not quite. I think I got like, I don't know, 20, 40 miles to Maine, 40 or 45 miles to Maine, something like that. So, going with Stephen King or Tom Clancy uh, to read for the rest of time. All right. I'll see you guys up the top of the hill. Bye. Ah, top of Wildcat Mountain. We're top of Wildcat D. I got more to go to get to the top of just another part of the Wildcat. That, that climb stunk. Ugh. Oh, now I got this. There you go. We got this to go up here behind the, I guess this is like the ski lodge hut. Uh, I'm about to put my, uh, it's getting chilly. I'm about to put my rain uh, shell on. Uh, this is not a day I feel like being out at all. Oof. It's getting harder and harder to get up every day, even though it's getting less and less miles to go. Still have 308, I think I just saw on the sign back there. Feels like forever. Let's go up this. More rocks. See ya. Uh, I gotta tell you, I really am ready to be done. I just, I just fell down the freaking backside of this hill. There's parts of this trail that are just absolutely freaking stupid and unsafe. There's just no way to get down them in the rain. It, it, I'm so frustrated right now. I got 300 and something miles to go and I don't want to be out here one more minute. It freaking hurt. I can't, I being, I'm moving slow, being careful and just went freaking down the rocks. Anybody that thinks that this is actually hiking has no, is just wrong. It's it's freaking climbing over stupid rocks. It isn't hiking. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I am so sick of being out here right now. So sick of it. Anyway. Well, okay, I'm done with it. I can't wait to get out of New Hampshire now. I had a nice day at Franconia Ridge. That was beautiful. And the weather sucked for four days and trying to climb down like a mountain goat. It's just ridiculous. Yeah, well, anyway, sorry. I just had to vent because I am not feeling it right now. And my backside and my freaking wrists are killing me now. I'll see you guys later. Alright, so I'm sitting on the top of the view at Wildcat Mountain. Five miles in. 
been hiking for like four and a half hours. So it tells you what kind of time I'm making. I'm going to have to go down. Put it in perspective. Down there. Looks like the corridor hut. Corridor lake hut is right there. And then I'm going to have to go up that into the, past the top of that mountain right there over there that's in the clouds and then over there somewhere I think and then down uh, this is a pretty view but I gotta tell you I'm really ready to be done with this just not fun. I'm moving so slow now. Every wet rock, I feel like I'm gonna fall on my rear end again, or worse, crack my head open. I'm like looking at that hill right there, going, "What the hell?" Like who in their right mind wants to walk up that thing? I guess I do. Well, I guess I'm not in my right mind to want to do that. I'm gonna stop down at that hut. And Take a break down there too, but good lord, this is this is a lot. Oh boy! All right, a couple more minutes here, and then probably take me two hours to go nine tenths of a mile to get down there and not fall on my head. See you in a bit. All right, I just came down from I think up there. Took me an hour and. 20 minutes to get down the mountain and uh, I'm going to go over and, and there's some blue sky but that's the only blue sky anywhere else I'm going to go check out Carter Hut and might see if they have room for the night and stay here for a half a day um, I just have no energy oh, there's a huge group coming right now oh, they're probably going to go they look like day hikers yeah I just don't have any energy and like even less desire to be out here and I, I got a huge climb to get out of here now so I'm going to take a rest at the hut see what the hut's all about and uh, see if maybe they have room for the night and maybe tomorrow will be a better day uh, I'll let you know what's going on once I get there see ya alrighty so it's like uh, it's like 1.30 I did 6.1 miles in a little less than six hours, and uh, I'm just dead. Uh, I'm not feeling it, so I just booked a room. I'm back here in bunk room number three. There's four bunks in there. Um, I don't know how crowded. They said they're not going to be very crowded, so who knows? Maybe I'll have that whole thing to myself. Um, and I'm just going to chill out and uh, watch a movie on, that I downloaded from yesterday. Uh, clouds are rolling in, so it, that blue sky just vanished, and... Uh, I don't know. It looks like it might rain. Um, yeah, I just need to. I, I you know, did, wasn't feeling it today. Legs didn't have it, even after a zero day yesterday. I thought that would have been, that would have got me totally ready to go. But um, I'm six hours in and six miles, and I had seven more to go. And I wasn't up for hiking 13 today. Um, well, I wasn't up for hiking 13 as of this point. I was when I woke up this morning, or at least I thought I was, but I gotta go up, uh, oh, I gotta go up that mountain right there. Uh, yeah, which looks like a pear. Carter Dome, and then a couple other drop downs and ups and stuff, so I'll look at that, I'll look at that in, in, the, in the bed here, and uh, figure out what I'm doing tomorrow. For the Would You Rather, um, what was it? Oh, uh, Tom Clancy books or Stephen King books. I'm not a big horror guy. Uh, I don't like horror movies. Uh, I love Tom Clancy's stuff. I've read, I probably read most of it, but I would read it again for sure. So I'm going to go with Tom Clancy and uh, for the win today. And, uh, yeah, I could use a Tom Clancy movie right now if I had one of those downloaded, but, uh, I don't think I do. Anyway, uh, hopefully tomorrow's a better day. See you guys later.